So the Google Ads Transparency Center is finally here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can, first of all, access this new tool from either YouTube ads or a search ad or a display ad, and how you can actually use this to spy on your competitors, um, get ad inspiration, and overall just leverage this tool to the best of your ability to help your business and overall help you do better on Google ads. Now, if you're new around here, my name is Blake Bauer and I'm the co-founder at Jetstream Digital, a digital advertising agency that helps businesses dominate digital advertising. So uh, if you find this content really valuable, I would really appreciate it if you could leave me a like and hit that subscribe button and also leave me a comment letting me know what you thought of the video. Uh, but now let's go ahead and jump into it and let me show you exactly how to use the Google ad transparency center. Uh, which is pretty much the same as the, the Facebook ad library, right? So let's go ahead and jump in. Okay, so here we are in the Google Ads Transparency Center. And the first way that you can actually get to the Google Ads Transparency Center is just to search up this URL right here, ads transparency.google.com and that'll automatically redirect you to the location or country that you are in. And right away you can tell it looks a lot like the Facebook ad library. And so if you're familiar with that tool, it's very, very similar. Now, before we actually explore how you can use this page, I'm gonna show you all the different ways that you can actually get here so that it's easier to find, right? So the first way is actually searching that URL. The second, you can actually just search Google ad library. Right, and you can scroll down here and you actually you'll see the Ads Transparency Center right there. Or you can just search up Google Ad right, Transparency Center as well and shows up right there. Right, another way that you can do this is if you have a particular competitor that you wanna look at, or if you see a search ad, you know, like a Google search ad that you actually wanna see their ads for, what you can do is search that competitor's name and a lot of you know brands run actual branded search ads and then you can actually see their ad and click on the three dots right here. And then that'll actually show you about this advertiser. And then you can just click on the see more ads tab right here. And that'll bring you to their ads in the Google ads transparency center. Right? And from there, you can actually change this, um, you know, in terms of location and formats, but we'll explore that in a little bit here, right? So if you have any other things that you want to search for, you know, maybe you have a particular, you know, a term that you want to see all your competitors for, and then you want to see their ads, maybe you're, you know, um, you know, you have uh, protein powder, right? And you want to see, you know, who's actually bidding on this, right? Awesome. And you can see some different competitors here. You can actually click on this and just check it out, right? And you can see right here, we have Reprise Media. Let's see, we have Cargill. See more ads by them. And then we have the Healthy News, right? Uh, and so you can see for this advertiser, actually, it's not showing uh, the see more ads option. And so you'll notice this for a lot of advertisers because this tool is fairly new. They actually don't have the data on all of the people using Google ads yet. They just have the kind of the main ones and the people that are spending quite a bit. So I'm assuming over time as this tool develops, more and more advertisers will get added to this until you know virtually all of the advertisers are you know on this and, and have some transparency behind that so so yeah just something to note there uh so that's another way you can access that uh another way is through youtube so if you actually go over to you know, let's say you're watching a youtube video here you know like a mr beast video uh, and then there's a youtube ad you can actually click on the little dot right here and then boom same thing that'll bring up the advertiser account click on see more ads and then you can see all of you know Canada One or uh, Capital One Bank's ads, right, in this particular case. And then lastly is display. So say you're on a display site, there's some display ads here, like these Adobe ones. What you can actually do is just click on the X here and then click Y this ad, and then you'll get some information about them as well, right? Uh, Adobe, United States, Seymour, and then boom, you can see their ads there as well. So that's pretty much how you actually can navigate to the ad library and see if you can actually have transparency and see the actual ads of the particular advertiser that that's in front of you and just how to get to this page overall. Now let's learn a little bit about how to use this tool for yourself, for your business. Uh, maybe you're an agency and you wanna use this tool to kind of spy your you know, competitors or do an audit for clients, right? It's a great tool for all those things. Okay, awesome. So now that we're back in the Ads Transparency Center, this is a great place to start if you have a particular business in mind that you wanna look up. So for us, let's just try like Alphalete, right? Alphalete Athletics, they have over 400 ads. And so we can click on them. And then you can actually just see what ads are running in Canada. They have 72 ads right here and you can actually preview these ads, right? And just kind of see, you know, last shown, this is a text ad, right? See more by this advertiser. 
you can look at kind of all these different ads that they have going here and just kind of explore this a little bit more. This is a display ad, looks like, or it's a shopping ad, it looks like. So uh, again, you can kind of see all of that, right? They have a shopping button, right? You can go back and just, you can literally just browse all their ads. And this is just in Canada. So what you can do is you can, you know, maybe you want to check out what, what they got going on in the United States. Awesome, you can check out all these ads here. You know, they have, uh, 15% off your first order. They have an offer going right here. Maybe you want to learn a little bit more about that. Check that out, right? And you can play around with these, right? So all you, what you can do as well is you can go anywhere, right? And you can go, uh, let's say, you know, today. What are they running today, right? Very, very uh, relevant to just kind of check out, uh, again, your competitors, what ads they're actually running today or in the last seven days, whatever it might be. Right, a specific date range and just get some more insights into your competitors and exactly what strategy they have. All the different ads that they're running, everything that they're doing is on display here for you to check out. And you know, more than that too, what you can actually do, you can filter the date range, you can filter the location, and then you can actually filter the format as well. So you can see what display ads are they running, what search text ads are they running, or what video ads are they running. So let's say we wanna check out their YouTube ads. Awesome, we can pull these up here. All right, check this out. Say there's a light. Right, motivational video there, and they have a ton of different video ads that they're running here that you can you know, just check out really. All right, so pretty cool stuff. Uh, and yeah, you can literally just check all of that out in the Transparency Center here. So that's a way that you can use that. Again, they don't have all of the different brands here yet. Uh, they have the main ones though, right? So if you search up, you know, like, Gymshark, uh, you know, Gymshark's gonna be there as well. But you know, your local mom and pop shop might not be on here quite yet. Uh, I think they're working to kind of roll that out for everybody, but they're starting with the kind of the big brands and working their way down. So there you have it. That's how to use the Google Ads Transparency Center or also known as the Google Ad Library uh, to spy on your competitors, to check out uh, and get ad inspiration, uh, figure out literally everything that you need to know about, you know, advertising and just being transparent with all of their different advertisers online. It's a super, super useful tool for advertising agencies like like me to just check out different competitors and also provide audits for different brands that we want to connect with. Um, so we would encourage you guys to do the same. Thanks so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. Leave me a comment letting me know what you thought of this tool overall and make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of the newest in digital advertising and digital marketing overall. Hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. Peace.